Hello and welcome to Holder's Crusade. Today we are in the Moors of Nock and we're going to be doing the quest, the next target. So this is a follow up to the last quest we did in uh, the Moors of Nock called the How Does the Grass Grow? You have to do that before you can do this one. So it starts here with Daka Nog, just like the other one. Let's go and hail her. Your actions are so hard so far have been encouragement encouragement you've stoked some fires outsider shall we continue what we started i wish to continue helping the cause good she looks around the area for any sign of yorgid your oreg <laughs> or another and her voice is kept low there is something disconcerting that i hope you can look into if you don't mind I can look into it. Also good. You've stumbled upon two years worth of work for me. Two years of sneaking and gathering information. Of building trust with the slaves. It may be for naught. For all. Though we ha are stretching thin. The Rallosians have grand desires. And their thirst for blood will not be quenched. But you are Rallosian. I am by culture. By heritage, by acknowledgement of our creation, she gives one soft shake of her head. But do I want to terrorize every living thing in this blasted land and the lands beyond? What did they do to deserve it? What did they, does it do beyond expanding our resources to go and do it again and again and again? Is there no end goal? Is there no respite? What is your goal? I want us to expand our knowledge. To learn to grow, we should approach these people with mutual understanding and be able to share our knowledge openly between us. She sadly smiles. How much more efficient would our path to enlightenment and magical exploration be if we didn't have to kill them? and then spend years translating, deciphering their texts. My people only care for the destructive, destructive power of arcane and care not about the intricacies of mana and the polar sources, or planar sources. It is a waste of our intellectual gifts. I agree, it is a waste. Thank you. Thank you for your understanding. So that leads me to the grand desires I am so concerned about. I worry we're on brink of multiple offensive. I'd like you to see if there's any additional information while I try to meet up with a few of my contacts. Are you willing to do that? I will seek the information. <laughs> All right, please search the base and the tower for any missives you might find. Uh, some higher rank personnel are more likely to have them on them. If you don't mind getting your hands dirty, she grits her teeth. I suppose it's very beneficial we have an outsider assisting. All right, so we need to obtain six unique uh, drops, if you will. Some are ground spawns, some are drops. So the first uh, three uh, drop for mobs in the tower, and I believe over here. So this general area is where we're going to be. You can see here four and five and six are ground spawns here. So uh, let's uh, let's go ahead and start doing some operations here. So let's get everybody following. Let's get this going. Everybody already has the quest. And good. <laughs> yeah. So uh, on that last quest, if you if you spawn the mobs and then wait, you know, like wait, get them under control and stuff like that, and then you can hail it again and it won't spawn more mobs. Uh, so if you're looking to uh, get that done on that last quest uh, for all your characters or something like that, it's a good uh, step there. All right, here is here is one of the missives right there on the ground. We don't have to kill anybody over here. And then I'm going to go grab the other ground spawns real quick before we start slaying here. All right, so the first one is, I believe, on the ground floor of the tower here. Go inside right over here on, on the table. I guess you can go right under it. There's one. 
And then uh, right up here. I think it's in here, right? I think we got to go up one more. It's been a while since I've uh, done this one. Ah, there it is right there. Right there. Grab it. All right. So we have the three that can be dropped. Uh, the rest of them are... Uh, I mean, uh, ground spawns. The rest of them are dropped. So we need to come over here and start killing, uh, killing these guys. So we take a look at this in here real, real quick before we start, right? Like there's a two pull, a one pull, a three pull, and a two pull down here. So, you know, this is a little tricky, uh, but outside here, you know, you get this uh, few pulls out here, right? It's not as bad. So it's just completely random, I guess, where they, uh, what drops and what doesn't. So <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and get into it here. Let's go find my guys. Where are they? They're over here. So I'm going to buff up and we can go. All right, let's go ahead and uh, try to find a nice position around here. I think right here is good. Let's go ahead and kill this guard. Uh, we're just going to fight our way in to avoid uh, train, training ourselves here. I have no idea what pathing is like right around here, but these mobs are... Definitely a step up from most of the mobs I've fought so far, so <laughs> it is uh, it's gonna be a fun time. There we go, and looking good. why you did not sing your song. I think I can go look right here. Alright, let's drop them right there. Let's get some speed. And see if we can get one of these guys. So it's pretty much just grinding these things until we get the drop. Um... What we're looking for is a Elder Missive, Unkept Woods Missive, and a Plane of Earth Missive. These all drop from uh, pretty much anything except guards, apparently, uh, according to Alakazam here. So, uh, yeah, the Dark Blade will drop one, theoretically. So, I guess we can ignore these guys from now on. Attacking. Perfect. All right, that guy is taken care of. Let's grab that guy. He slowed. Get him dotted up. Perfect. I think anyway. <laughs> oh, there we go. I'm uh, I'm trying out the long dots thing on my necromancer. I've been mentioning it for a while. I'm just trying to see how much better it is than uh, the short dots, if you will. And by long dots, I mean the uh, the longer than 30 second ones that uh, that I'm, I'm traditionally not using. I don't even have all the focuses for them yet, so. Alright, I guess we're doing a two pull here. Which should be fine, right? Except if they're going to kill the bard, I mean, come on now. Right, 
right here slow. Let's get him dotted up. See, they're uh, really pushing out the damage on these two here. So we're going to swap over to this guy and slow him. I find slow works a lot better on these tier 2 mobs than pretty much anything else. Because they, they just have so much higher output. And uh, since we are not 125, we're you know missing... You know, a bunch of AAs and all that other stuff that I think this content is really tuned for, so. Oh my gosh, this Necro is uh, missing, pissing me off. I guess he's like fizzling spells. <laughs> like, I don't know what's going on. Keeping it, I'm counting it in my head, right? Like I'm staring at this screen. I'm like, why are you not casting at this point? Every every spell's on a 45 uh, pause, right? Just weird. There we go. Looking good. getting no drops at all this is uh fantastic absolutely fantastic so maybe the ones outside don't drop it all right what do we got in here got two soldiers that coming anyway all right oh and we got a third one back here chaos oh and the bard is down Bard is down for the count. <laughs> Absolutely destroyed. Uh, please slow that guy. I'll rest her in a moment. Right, he's slowed. Where's the other one? Dark Blade, I think it was, right? All right, so this is not a safe place to sit. Now we know that. All right, we're gonna do mantle. Take a little bit of a breather off of us on that. And let's get some dots on here. Hard rezzed. her going click her feather of unity or phoenix feather or whatever get her a little bit of resources back all right let's multi-dot here There we go. Under control. <laughs> uh, one of the one of the problems I have right now is I don't have uh, none of my AOE taunts. I didn't put any points in them yet, AA wise. So I don't think they even work on these uh, higher level mobs. It's uh, just kind of funny, right? Uh, but I, I didn't expect the bar to just get flattened right away since the, apparently the Necro got hit. And the pet took it off of him and saved his life. Because uh, I turned off Greater Hold uh, a while back to uh, make things a little bit funner uh, when it comes to uh, pulling mobs. All right. There we go. We got nothing off these guys yet. Come on. Click your feather and mount. 
and Modra. That'll give you a few moments of uh, mana regen. So the, the feather is just so awesome. It's like a mini paragon. Look at this. Like my mana regen goes up to 2200. And it's just like, oh yeah, thank you very much. There we go. Alright, let's move the bard back a little bit. I feel like she's a little too awkward in the uh, positioning there, so. Alright. Two dark blades? Critically, this is doable. Splash heal that. Nope, not curable. Whatever. Sky one slowed. All right, he slowed. Swap. Move just a little closer. There we go. Excellent. Get everybody dotting up. Looking good. Alright, let's uh, feather on you. Now, the cleric, I don't think she has Yelp up at the moment. It's up. So she's like 2600 mana regen just standing without a mount. Uh, apparently on you, you, know, you can't Yelp in a mount or, mount or something like that. I can't remember what, what the stipulation was, but can't do them both at the same time on one of these guys. I can't remember which one. There we go. Okay, good. Let's go ahead and do a disintegrate mind on the necro. I can't believe we gotten a, haven't gotten a single drop yet. This is a little ridiculous. Oh, really? Yeah. Hopefully it dropped. I can't remember if it dropped six at a time. I remember we had a lot of them rotting when I did it on my Necromancer, but it's hard to say. Go, it's a Dots, Poison Crafter. Video, I mean, killing the same guys over and over again. So, what I'll do is I'm just gonna grind these until I get uh, a drop, and then we'll uh, go from there. Alrighty, we got our first uh, missive drop here. I just wanted to kind of show. Came off a blood bay, blood, blood blade, uh, and I got three. So, uh, uh, everybody needs one of these. So. Uh, I'm just going to grind out the rest of these because uh, I've been here for uh, over an hour just grinding. This is the first one I got. So this is time consuming. I even tried going up in the tower. Uh, I got destroyed by a roamer and then aggro through the wall or something. I don't know, but I'm just going to grind out the rest of these missives and then we'll go from there. Alrighty, and then here off a tactician, we got unkempt woods. Which is the final missive we need for uh these guys. Oh my gosh, another one. Alright. <laughs> so oh, and we got uh Planar Earth off the uh cutthroat. So uh 
let's see here. That one goes to you. There we go. And I got plain earth off of uh, something else before. All right, so that is all six missives, and uh, we'll go turn these in here in just a second after I clean up this mess. <laughs> I literally died in the tower. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned that earlier, but uh, yeah, there is more than one roamer, uh, just FYI. And uh, the pathing is uh, less than ideal, but uh, we're, we're doing pretty good here now. I haven't gotten anything off a of soldier yet. Uh, I don't think the dark blades either. I saw blood blades and anything that's got some kind of like title, like a military title, like a sergeant or a lieutenant or something like that. All of those, the ones that drop them. But I, I mean, what am I at? 49%? So <laughs> uh, I've been getting 0.1 per kill. So it's pretty. Uh, pretty nice all right and then to consolidate we just right click on one of them and it gives us one and we need to go give that to her so I'll run do that here after this guy dies and we can wrap this one up but uh yeah a little rough uh like two two I have no problem with three it gets a little full. four is like hey what's going on and uh five is like oh my gosh don't do that all right let's uh our cloak evolved i was like where did your cloak go all right let's uh go over here to daka and uh, turn this in And she's up here on the hill. Hopefully we don't have to kill anything. Give that over. There we go. She thumbs through the stack given to her. The look on her face is growing more tense every second. Yeah, I knew that one. I'm aware of that one. What? How much they plan to spread us out? And what is this? Alright, let's hail her. Alright, 2.5% experience. 141 platinum uh she's concerned with the future of the blood thirsty thirsty nature of her people uh this is preposterous in order to help bolster the ranks of our armies to handle the ever-growing list of targets they're going to construct additional beast handlers and students of the arcane time is running out and fast let me know when you're ready to talk about more all right there we go there's one more quest in this zone, and it is uh, slow down the march. This one will uh, involve more killing, and we'll be doing that next time. So thank you very much for watching, and please have a fantastic day.